Hello friends, this is Holmes, the first time farmer, over 50. Welcome to the homestead. So uh, yesterday was Friday, September, nope, Friday, October the 13th. Today is Saturday, October the 14th. And uh, yesterday it was my goal to finish up the remaining part of the western property line. And um, I was able to get it finished last night but it got too dark to shoot some video, so I'm taking care of that this morning. So, as you can see, there's still a lot of cedars up through here, but the cedars are really thick, and they are pretty big. These are in the neighborhood of probably 40 feet tall or so, and there's just no, not a lot of room to, to, to drop these. So, for the time being, I'm just going to leave these, and uh, work around them and uh, we'll get back to them at a later time and thin them out more but for right now I think we're good so what we had remaining was the last 150 feet up the hill to the road again this is the western property line and through here is mostly cedars and honeysuckle um, lots of honeysuckle and that took a long time cutting all of those out and finding a place to put them so there's one pile that's a it's mostly honeysuckle there's a little bit of cedar mixed in with that and there's a cedar log there that i left it's a dead ash tree that's been laying there a long time Right here, there are a couple of ash trees that I cut down last night. And uh, the one that's in multiple pieces, <laughs> that got caught on a tree on one of these, on this one actually, on that cedar tree right there. And uh, so I, it was leaning, so I had to make a cut. And when I cut and it broke, the top snapped off and came back. So that's where everything landed right there so these things are these things are really dangerous you really got to be careful with them but i was kind of anticipating that would happen so i was able to get out of the way without any problems at all but if you're out there cutting cutting down these old ash widow makers just be gotta be really really careful and then here's another pile of honeysuckle with a little bit of cedar added in. And we are almost up to the road. And here's the, the last pile again, mostly honeysuckle with a little bit of cedar as well. And here's the road. So I anticipated this taking me um, well, I was, I was giving it like five weeks to get it done to, from, the, from the very back end of the property up here. And um, I just wasn't sure what I was going to run into. Wasn't as bad as I thought. And I literally did it in uh, two weeks. So started on it Friday, September the 29th and finished it on Friday, October the 13th. So it was a, a pretty quick process. I'm really glad that's taken care of. And now we get to start over here, working our way down the road. And I'm not going to start in this location right here. I'm actually going to start at the far end um, on the western side of the yard and work my way across just because it's a lot less travel time instead of walking down here and cutting across. So that's the next plan, starting that today, and uh, my goal is to get that done in the next two to three weeks as well. So we appreciate you watching. Please hit like and subscribe, and look forward again to seeing you in the future, but if not, we're going to see you in the pasture.